Hello everyone, Derek here with uh, brand new Game & Watch. Kind of unexpected because Pokemon Duel has arrived for iOS and Android devices. And uh, yeah, it's... From what I'm aware of, I don't know much about Pokemon Duel. Uh, it is a game based on an old board game that used a bunch of figures. Now, granted, the... I think what made it fail is that the figures itself themselves were very expensive. Oh, you guys get to see my birthday. Uh, one sec. <laughs> I guess I'm putting... I, I As if you can't tell, this is the first time I've played this at all. So, let me see here. Uh, not 2017. Oh, okay, apparently I could be born in 1902. Good to know. Come on, let me get to 1985. God, when you're old, it takes forever. <laughs> oh, 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 we went too far. Okay, there we go. Submit. Accept the terms of use because always. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I can read that totally. <laughs> Alright, but yes, uh, apparently Pokemon Duel is based on an old uh, board game. Uh, no, don't send me those. <laughs> and uh, the uh, I don't know exactly what the gameplay is going to be like or anything like that, but I, I do know that Joe Merrick of Cerebi has been covering the game for a while. Um... Uh, where it was called Pokemon Co-Master, and he seemed mostly frustrated by it. So, we'll see. But as you can see, there's different figurines for each, and with over 700 Pokemon and with how expensive they were, it just wasn't a possibility. So, we'll see how this game actually plays. I mean, it's kind of cool that you can have online battles. I just need to know what the battles are like. But this is essentially a board game on your phone. And it looks like we got to wait for some uh, loading, so we'll cut back until well, this is fully loaded, so one sec. Alright, there we go. Only took about eh, four or five minutes, maybe three, I don't know. Enough. <laughs> so, we're finally in. Let's tap the screen. Oh, it takes a while to connect, jeez. That is one thing about this so far, it takes a while to connect. Uh, hopefully it quickens after some time, or gets a little faster or something, but... Oh well. It is kind of cool how Ho-Oh is on the front and, like, front and center. That's a strange... It's an interesting choice. You don't see Ho-Oh get represented too often. Alright. And... We're in! Awesome. Well, we got to see this guy, uh, Rosé. The day you've all been waiting for has arrived. At last, I am proud to announce the commencement of the Pokemon Figure Game World Championships. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is the grand prize. The glorious Jewel Tower in all of its splendor. Wait, I can win a tower for... It's still going on. For... <laughs> Holy crap, for just winning a children's figure game? Awesome. Anyway, today, uh, Carmonte Island welcomes the cream of the PFG crop. Of, of you elite players, only one shall prevail victorious. The PFG World Championships are now officially underway. This concludes our broadcast from Carmonte Island. Okay. Cool. Let's win a tower. Why not? Huh. Got somebody on a, sitting next to us on the plane already. He's well dressed. Uh, yeah, I am. Uh, yeah, I sure am. I knew it. And we're immediately rivals. <laughs> it's a plane. You're you're fine. How long have I been playing PFG? Uh, it's my... F 
Here we, it's my first time. Go easy on me. <laughs> I love that. Like, what? Uh, nope. I love how the guy before said, we're bringing in the cream of the crop, but I have never played a single time before. Sure. You just got on the plane and we've already arrived? You were finding your seat. Were you hitting on the waitresses or the stewardesses? Anyway, that's Carmonte Island over there. Uh, it's... There's a lot of towers. Maybe we have to work our way through the towers in order to win that final tower. Oh good. Security. <laughs> ah, you need my name, huh? Alright, we'll just use the good old Twitter handle. Okay, we're not doing that. Just bit nerd then. <laughs> actually, you know what? We'll just go with my name. <laughs> Whatever. It'd be weird. It'd be weird to me if everybody's calling me bit nerd. Well, that was easy. Great that border control actually takes care of that. All right, we got a dual set. I got oh, not terrible to begin with, I'd say. At least we got all the start uh, Gen One starters. You'd be wanting needing one of these too. A mask, really? Hmm. Okay, then. You never know who you're fighting. Oh, cool. We actually get to change our appear appearance. Um, hmm. What kind of crazy hair do we want to have? I like how there's no gender option. You sort of decide it based on the hairstyle that you give your character. Like, there's obviously... These are girl hairstyles. Uh, so let's go back over. I kind of like that one. What kind of crazy hair do we want? Blue. Brown. Green. Oh, I can... I, I can you could almost dress yourself up like Will from the... Uh, from Gen 2. <laughs> Uh, let's let's go as close to myself as possible. Uh, a little bit. There we go. I think that does it. Yeah, it seems all right. Cool. There I am. Yep. Yes, <laughs> I need to know the rules. In a weird way, I'm reminded of the Pokemon trading card game game on Game Boy. <laughs> All right, this is where duels take place. There are figures for practicing, uh, so let's duel. The first spin decides who starts. Okay. There's plenty involved here, that's for sure. Alright, we're taking on Luca. Oh, okay, that's kind of cute. They actually have a table for us and all that. <laughs> oh, we got Eevee, too. Oh, it's a practice set, that's why. Dang it. First move is yours. Okay. The conditions for winning are simple. All you have to do is get one of your figures to the goal on the opponent's side. Hmm. Okay, simple enough. The six points closest to you are your... Uh, 
to you are your bench. All the figures in your deck are lined up there. Let's take a look at one of your figures. Alright. Tap a figure to see its status and the number of spaces it can move. Now time to make a move. Alright, uh, let's do... Oh. Ah, uh, okay, for the move... Alright, uh, grab that, and... Do I... Oh, he wants me to go there. I'm go trying to go to the left, and I'm going to the right. Okay. Once you move your figure, that's the end of your turn. Now it's my turn. Okay, so it's placement first. Interesting. Well, that didn't seem fair. Alright, we'll go there to stop your Voltorb. Alright, your figure can't move into or past a point occupied by an opponent figure. Makes sense. Not unless you knock them out, so I gotta have a battle. Cool. I feel like I'm not it's not responding to my inputs. Alright, battles are decided by which attack you spin on the wheel. Stop the wheel and use an attack. Uh now. Oh cool, tackle. Ha, huh, get out of here. A blue attack is a dodge, and a red attack is a miss. Okay. Also, purple and gold attacks, which have various effects. You'll learn them as you go. If you miss, literally any hit. If you miss, literally any hit will beat you. So you want to avoid them if you can. <laughs> Sent to the Pokemon Center. Okay. This one and oh I can choose any of these so they want me to go here all right Bulbasaur get out there all right a different technique just like that and ooh surround them okay I kind of figured that out if you surround an opponent figure on all sides you automatically beat them oh that's cool Now's your chance. If you use a plate here, you'll be able to take control. What's a plate? Oh, this is a plate. Why not use Meadow Power? Grass-type Pokemon deal plus 20 damage. This effect lasts until one of your Pokemon's po opponent's Pokemon is knocked out by a grass-type Pokemon. Your turn ends. Alright. And done. Aha! Vine Whip. I would have beat you anyway, but I'll take the extra power. Alright, and they actually... It looks like they have the amount of time they are. Once three Pokemon are sent to the Pokemon Center, the first one... They, ah, okay. I was wondering how they come back. But any figure rejoining the bench has enters weight status first. It means they can't be used for one turn. Okay, these rules make sense so far. Anyway, let's choose Bulbasaur and uh, win the game. There you go. It was a teaching game. I'm pretty sure you weren't trying your hardest. <laughs> but yay, we won. Oh wow, <laughs> it's going to take a while to get a league promotion, that's for sure. Whatever that is. Twelve hundred points to get a league. It's the next league. Okay. Cool enough. One up by fifteen. And now I got an unexpected error. That's a good sign. All right, let's return to the title screen. See what happens when I need to get back into it. There's a lot of connecting in this.
that's my one big concern right now is just how much connecting there is and other stuff involved. I don't know. It might just be because there's, you know, that it's just been released. Everybody's picking up. The game is free uh, with just in-app purchases. So, you know, microtransactions and all that. Hmm. All right, great. Thanks for, thanks for you for the opening. At least it connected. Uh, did all that pretty quick. Oh, are you telling me it has to wait for this connecting thing every single time? Really? Hopefully it gets faster. Okay, there we go. I was going to say, if it takes forever, I am not sure about this game. <laughs> At least for my own purposes. <laughs> Okay, definitely faster than the initial time. I'm, I'm okay with that. Still took a little while, but... There we go. Alright, suspended data found. We missed out on the... Di oh, okay. Are you kidding me? I have to do the... Skip... Yes. I'm not going to sit there again. Alright, if you want to change the figures in your deck, you can do it with this button, okay? Uh, I like how the figures actually look like figures, I will say that. Uh, okay, there's the figures currently set on the deck. Oh, I gotta get Pikachu in there, get dang Rattata out, and put the Raticate in. Oh, really? We're, we're re replacing uh, Spiro first? Alright, cool. Simple enough. Display settings, got it. Ah, okay. Can't have... Uh, three is still half your team, though. Alright, let's go to the leagues. I can't help but want to feel that this game would be a lot easier to navigate if I had a tablet. <laughs> anyway, let's just get to the leagues and see what happens. I can open up a locked booster. When you've collected 10 key fragments, you'll be open, able to open a locked booster. If you win a duel, you get three, and even if you lose, you get one. But you can only get up to four fragments from losing matches. Well, let's open it. All right, what's in a locked booster? It is a rare metal, you see, okay. Rare metals will give a lot of XP to your Pokemon when used as a used as a fusion ing ingredient. Let's give it a try. All right, now we're learning about fusing. All right, let's try fusing your Pikachu. All right, there's Pikachu. The figure is set now. Cool. Figures for upgrading. Oh, this one. Alright, figures gain, gain XP from fusion. When they reach a certain amount of XP, they will level up. Alright, let's do a fusion. So I can sacrifice duplicate figures in order to get EXP. Okay. That's cool. What happens when we level up, though? Alright, the figure used will be absorbed, so watch watch out before you commit. Yeah, I figured as much. Oh, okay. As you level up figures, you can... As you level up figures, you can increase the size of their attacks and decrease the size of the misses. 
Choose one of your attacks to increase. You can't increase a miss. Well, that's good. I don't want to. Let's see. Uh, let's increase the size of quick attack. Here we go. There we go. Yeah, that increase. If I increase the size of quick attack, it makes. Um, the miss smaller it looks like yeah it definitely makes the miss smaller so it's actually good to focus on quick attacks we'll do that yes okay I like it plus quick attack is stronger than thundershock <laughs> and I got a message okay All right. Thank you for entering the PFG World Championships as part of taking. As thank you for taking part. Here's a complimentary booster ticket. Okay. Let's find out what booster tickets do. Boy, this is a long tutorial. Luca, you got a booster ticket for playing. Let's go to the shop and exchange it. Alright, what's in the shop? We got a maid. Got We can purchase gems, exchange coins. Alright, this is the shop. You can exchange figures and plates here. Let's exchange a, a booster right now. Boosters contain rare figures, which will come out. Uh, what will come out? So exciting. I'm pretty sure it's canned for the first time, but we'll see. You can always exchange them with gems, but if but you have a booster ticket, so this time it won't cost you anything. Uh huh. All right, let's get the booster. And if you get a boost of four pack, you're guaranteed to get a drop of at least one rare or e or EX figure. Okay, yeah, I can definitely. This is basically like a trading card game except with figures, and uh, yeah, gotta collect them all, right? All right, let's see what we got. Okay, I do like the physical act of tapping. It just, I don't know, it just makes it feel a little bit cooler. Hey, we got a Pichu with its eyes closed. You blink for the picture, dude. And a material. Cool. Alright. Uh, you can practice dueling techniques in the training center if there's uh, something you don't understand in the rules. You can look and help too. If you want to see information about rankings, tap there. Your your duel statistics can be seen. Oh boy, I'd be bad. If you want to duel against friends or people near you, use the room match option. And if you want to watch other players, oh okay, at least you can. That's cool. You can actually watch other people. And there's quest. All right, and that's it for Lucas tutorial apparently. All right, let's finish waiting for it to connect, and then we'll take a look, I suppose. All right, so you can get used coins, gems. Interesting. Of course, there's a sale going on. Oh, okay. 
Got a login bonus. So yeah, gems are definitely the currency this time around. And what else is coming up? Uh, okay, cool. There's a lot of stuff going here. They have a lot of deals going on. Today, just, yeah. <laughs> I will say the interface is very slow to me. All right, we got daily missions where we can play one. If we want, we want to play one league match, one uh, room match, and win two league matches. Okay. Oh, and okay. There's daily missions, reward lists. Okay, cool. Not too surprising. Okay. All right, let's look at this. New stuff in there. Okay, that's just the same old stuff that we saw before. Let's get an actual game in here and see how we do. Oh, we got three messages. Okay, we got more uh, gems. That's cool. I think I hit that. Yeah, we, yeah, we, yeah, we did. Uh, at least we, at least there are ways to get the gems. Of course, it just takes longer. Uh, I don't think it's enough for one of those four packs, though. Let me. T I'll take a quick look, but I don't think it's enough. Check the shop and get a booster. Am I broke? And is that why? Oh, that's why it's connecting. Oh my goodness. The constant connecting is crazy. Ah, I need to get to. Need to get to 300 if I want to get um, that booster. That makes sense. All right, cool. Let's go to the quest. See what kind of trouble we get into next. <laughs> or just more Luca. You've never had an AI before? Okay, you got... Uh, oh, okay. Okay. Let's start the AI, I guess. <laughs> uh, we're going through time and space, apparently. What the heck kind of device are they giving me? Oh, it's Carlo. Ta-da! To what? <laughs> Alright, we have the AI Carlo helping us out. Well, <laughs> Of course, we got a special one. <laughs> All right. Ulex. Or Ulex. One of the two. All right. Clear the quest on each floor and work your way to the top of the hotel. Okay, that's what the green meter at the top is. It, 
each match takes a little bit out of you. That's how they limit you. Okay. <laughs> I was wondering why I had an HP meter. Alright. That's a lot of Bidoofs. Alright. Not too bad from what I can tell. Doesn't seem like typings come into play either. Uh, the hotel should provide the stage for the PF... It looks like this island is nothing but hotels. Each hotel's owner lies in wait on the top of their floor. They hold with them an emblem representing that hotel. The first player to collect all nine emblems and ascend Jewel Tower and defeat its owner, yours truly, shall be crowned champion. Okay, well we got our gems, essentially. Okay, so basically by ruling the tower means that just you're the best. Alright. Only those who collect at least five emblems may remain in the tournament. This <laughs> is not a team game. Take out everybody around you. <laughs> Alright, we're off, we're off. Complete newbie taking on the world. Yeah, let's do it. I've been trying to do another game for a while now. Alright, concierge, let's see what you got. Let's see how we want to start this. We'll begin with... Bulbasaur. And... Let's start here. I feel like I have a lot of movement options with that. Wordle. Go here and block him. And, oh, we can actually fight. That's a big miss I just noticed, Squirtle. But I believe in you. Let's kick his butt. Oh, crap. <laughs> I just got my butt kicked by a Bidoof. All right. Uh, Charmander, are you any better? That's a huge miss. Let's... What about Pikachu? Alright, yeah, let's put Pikachu in the way. Squirtle did not work out. I could use the AI, but I want to do this on my own, so... Move Bulbasaur over here, force him to try to defend. Then I can get Pikachu up. Alright, he's challenging me. And boom! Yes! Vine Whip! Take that, Bidoof. And it's my turn. Let's win this. Once again, Bulbasaur is apparently the best starter. Holy crap. There we go. That quick and easy. Of course you want to learn your decks and all that stuff, but that's that's the essentials, I guess. I again, I'd say my big my my biggest issue with the game uh, is the fact that the connecting takes so long. It really slows down the pace of everything.
Hmm. Yep. That's a very slow pace. All right. Oh, uh, you completed challenges. Your rewards have been sent to your inbox. Oh, there's apparently a weight victory. All right, well, we're just certainly throwing stuff at you. Oh, we got a spin. Spin! We get... 250 coins. Cool. So, yeah, there's definitely, we can use, okay, so it's basically just teaching you and there's different things you can earn for and replay and keep going that way. We'll do one more match so we actually have some gameplay in here and uh, we'll see how it goes. All right, I was going to say, if you're going to charge me for it, I'm not going to do it. Um, okay. Sure. Oh, I don't know what that means. <laughs> I really don't. Oh, okay, if I'm over a thousand points, my deck is good. Okay, cool. Let's do it. Okay, I definitely want to lead with that Pikachu, though. Pikachu and Bulbasaur are definitely my team at the moment. We'll check out, uh, we, we'll, we'll check out Rattata and Raticate as well. And Charmander. Alright. Charmander, that's, uh, Raticate. Man, he's either really good or really terrible. <laughs> Uh, let's do... Yeah, I gotta, I gotta be honest. I gotta stick with Bulbasaur and Pikachu for now. Send out Bulbasaur there. Feels like a good opening gambit to me. Pikachu on the other side, so I can... Surround him. And then... over there. Really, if my movement's... Oh, okay, okay. He was able to challenge me. I was gonna say. Oh, no! I didn't realize Bulbasaur had that huge miss. Crap! Man, Bidoof's are not, nothing to joke about. Alright, let's move up Pikachu in that case. Oh, are they gonna surround me? I forgot about that tactic. Alright, I have to take this Fletchender out. Or Fletchling, I'm sorry. There we go. Nice Thunder Shock. And. Thunder Wave. Oh, wow. One pre-chosen attack becomes a miss. That's crazy. That could be devastating. Holy crap. Alright, finish connecting. <laughs> I'm trying to pick Pikachu and... There we go. My phone's a little. <laughs> my phone's not the biggest, so I actually, yeah, I, I feel like this would work a lot better on a tablet. Anyway, we won. It's simple, but I could definitely see a lot of strategies at play here, and there is a bit of luck. But the leveling system actually kind of mitigates that luck, and that's what makes the other Pokemon that you can pick up very interesting. So I can see this being relatively addicting if you're into it. I'm not going to say it's the best. Uh, the load times leave a lot to be desired. 
but for what it is, it's not bad. All right, let's spin it to win it. What do we get this time? Blue. Hey, we got a Bidoof. Everybody loves Bidoof, right? All right, let's uh, let's go back and what do we want? Uh, there it is. Get the messages. And let's just get all the items. I <laughs> don't care. And that only put me up to 171. So, yeah, it's going to be a while till I have enough to get one of those other booster packs. But there you go. Anyway, guys, that is uh, Pokemon Duel. I think that's long enough for now. <laughs> uh, you know what, actually? Let's, let's take on Meryl real quick. One time. Just so we ha actually have some real gameplay in all of this. <laughs> uh, it's mostly been loading and uh, tutorials. All right, Meryl rolls out. Rolls out. Let's see how we do. Uh, do I want? Actually, let's edit my deck real quick. Let's see how Badoof is in comparison. Edit figures. Oh. Okay, we learned something new. Now you can set evolutions for your Pokemon, so I'll explain a little bit about evolution. You can set evolutions from your edit figure screen. Let's go there now. Okay, what's this all about? Alright, set the figure to evolve. Now that this, is de this deck is set, the evolve button has appeared. Select it now. Only certain figures can evolve. You cannot select an evolved Pokemon that is already set in the same deck. Alright. Oh! That's actually really cool! Gives you a bit more options. Oh, uh, okay. But if you evolve it, it doesn't gain experience. Interesting. Well, let's edit the figures and we'll actually change it up so we can have all of them in there. Actually, how is Spiro? Um. All oh, right, I have a Pichu as well. I forgot about that. I wish there was a was there a way to really look. All right. Well, let's put in the bid bidoof. Uh, that's not what I wanted. Let's hit the evolve button and get. Radicate in there. And that all looks good from what I have. I could do the same for um, Pichu and Pikachu, but I'm not sure if that's worth it or not. I w really wish I could look at the stats somehow, but I'm not seeing it. Oh, I gotta push and hold. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, 60, 40. Okay, and even have abilities. Dang, okay. And how's Spiro? Yeah, Spiro sucks. <laughs> Holy crap. How's Bidoof? Wow. Bidoof rocks. Alright, we're going to keep the figures like this then. 
Uh, I could put in Pichu to do that, but uh, I'm good. All right. We'll just keep it a Pikachu so Pikachu gets the experience. Looks good. Go back once more. And let's play. Feeling pretty good about this. And they get to go first. All right, so I have to adjust based on what they do. What are you guys gonna do? I got Meryl there. In that case, we'll send out Bulbasaur here. That way I can come back if I need to. Alright, Meryl's going right for it. Oh, he didn't actually attack. Interesting. Right, let's send out Pikachu. Ooh, Sleep Powder. Nice. And he missed, so he just gets taken out. Alright, this Pokemon is asleep. In this condition, it cannot move move until it is tagged by an ally Pokemon or battled by an opponent Pokemon. So it's in my way, but I no longer have to worry about it anymore. That's cool. Well, in that case, let's just move Pikachu up. I would like to get some Bidoof action in here because he's awesome, but... This will do. Ooh, a tie! What happens at a tie? Nothing. Okay. Oh. Wow. You failed. Ha! I win! <laughs> Alright, well, that was something. Oh, goodness. Yeah. I mean, if anything get more, gets more complicated, I'd just use Bidoof, but there we go. Head concierge. I'm. There we go. That's a bit more experience. Now we're talking. All right. And let's spin it. Two hundred fifty coins. Seems like blue is the better option in my opinion. But man, eh, what are you gonna do? So, yeah, again, I mean, I guess it's good the battles are short because, you know, it's a uh, cell phone game, but <laughs> there you go. Oh, I got a mask for winning. And for that, okay. And we can see how tall the tower is on there, uh, on the side here. Nice. All right, well, that is... Uh, Pokemon Duel, <laughs> there's uh, definitely quite a bit of content here, uh, plenty to spend it on and all that, and we can actually see how quickly uh, it takes to get your um, status back, so not fortunately you don't have to wait too long, uh, I'd say you can get, probably get a good hour of combat in there and still may, maybe get it there, uh, but yeah, that is the basics of the game, and it seems relatively fun, uh, I got... Like I said, my biggest complaint is the load times, and the rest of it, I mean, the battles are quick, but I can definitely see where strategy might come into play and how you need to change up your Pokemon as you go along. So, relatively simple, some definite depth in here, and hey, it's free to check out. You don't have to spend any money if you don't want to. So, give it a look, and of course, stay tuned to Game Explained for more on Pokemon and other things gaming too. Till next time, bye.